Hello again, my friends, and thank you for watching this video. Um, I have exciting news. I have really happy news. And uh, unfortunately, I also have a bit of sad news. But I would like to start with the happy news, uh, with your permission, okay? So the, the happy news is that we did it. We did it. You and me, we did it together. Um, on Black Friday, I announced a, a discount sale on my courses. And um, I told you that it doubles as a crowdfunding project to double the weekly lessons on Lick and Riff. So we did it. We did it. The Black Friday sale, which continued into a holiday season sale, um, it worked. And um, now I can free up more time to film more lessons and double the weekly lesson uh, output. And um, I already started filming it and it's it's really exciting. Um, I can do a lot more than uh, just finger style. I, I can uh, give you all sorts of lessons instead of just focusing on finger style so you can broaden your uh, horizons, your musical horizons, your musical experiments and your own personal musical journey. So I'm going to give you a lot more uh, starting next Saturday. We're going to have two weekly lessons here on Lick and Riff. Thanks to you, the kind people who watch my videos, the kind people who support me on Patreon and the kind people who purchase my courses. And, um, you know, just to give you something back for giving me something back, uh, the discount for my courses is still on as a new year sale so uh, for those of you who missed it uh, you can still go get my courses for a discount price um, so thank you thank you so much and um, starting next Saturday we're gonna have two weekly lessons here on Lick and Rift so um, two lessons a week thank you this is like a dream come true for me um, also I would like to thank you for being such a wonderful audience and uh, for being here and as long as you're here I'm gonna do my absolute best to be your guitar teacher even though I don't personally know you I feel like I do so thank you thank you thank you the sad news um, is that uh, the little dog uh, she passed away she passed away a couple of weeks ago and um, she was 16 years old and um, she she was an amazing dog amazing 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 and um as sad as it is um i want you to know i want you to know that first of all uh the dogs uh give me a moment sorry um the dogs their names are not lick and riff those are their stage names um, I'm not that much of a guitar fanatic. Um, the big dog's name is Joey. And the small dog's name was Chica. And Chica was a legend. She was a legend. I wish you could know her better than just watching her sit on the couch. She lived life on her own terms. She never did anything that she didn't want to do. And I was... More than I was her owner, I was kind of her slave. Um, her life story is unbelievable and if I would tell you stories you won't even believe me uh, she was such an unbelievable dog and I want to thank you for all the love that you showed the dogs as well and um, Chica also um, she, she was so such an amazing dog that even uh, even at 16 when she she was she, she was just turned 16 we went to give her some blood tests and they had to, three veterinarians had to hold her down so they could take her blood. She was that much of a fighter. She had a fighting spirit to the end, to the last day. And um, she was an amazing, amazing, amazing dog. She had such a terrific personality and she was, she, she was just incredible. Maybe one day I'll, I'll, I'll show you videos or, or uh, tell you stories if you'd like. Uh, so she passed away. She passed away. She did. She was not in any pain. Um, and right up to the last moment, she lived life on her own terms. Um, she, she was the one who decided that that was it. Um, so she chose her successor. Uh, me and my wife, uh, we have two cats as well. And she chose, Chica chose uh, her own successor. And um, let me show you. 
<laughs> this little guy. Um, his name is Raul because he likes to say Raul, Raul, and um, he's a really nice cat. Um, albeit cats are unpredictable and uncontrollable, so they're not like dogs. You can't really bribe them. Um, the dogs uh, get paid in vegetables every time we film lessons. Um, the, the big dog, Joey, he gets a full carrot, which he just sits and nibbles on for uh, 10 minutes or so after filming. And Chica used to get uh, carrots as well. And, uh, and cucumber, uh, they really love uh, vegetables. So if you have dogs, give them vegetables. Uh, they love it. Um, it's a healthy treat. Uh, so two weekly lessons starting next Saturday and um, and uh, what can I, what else can I say then uh, I love you I, I love you all and uh, I'm gonna as long as you want me to be your teacher uh, I'll, I'll I'll be happy to do it thank you for watching we'll see you next lesson